Hillsborough County Fire Rescue is mourning the loss of one of their own after a crash claimed the life of a firefighter. Investigators say 50-year-old Stephen Haberlin was off duty last night driving on Cortez Boulevard in Brooksville when he lost control of his SUV and slammed into a tree. Fox 13's Evan Axelbank is live on 78th Street in Tampa where he was stationed with more on how he's being remembered tonight. Evan. Well, and he is being remembered as a community servant who answered calls here in Hillsborough County for nearly 20 years. You can see right now the colleagues, his colleagues here at Fire Station 1 on 78th Street have lowered the flag here to half staff. Troopers say that his vehicle was the only vehicle involved in the crash that took his life. Tire treads and debris are still at the crash site along Cortez Boulevard, west of I-75. Troopers say that on Tuesday, just before 5 p.m., 50-year-old Stephen Haberland of Dade City was driving a Chevy Silverado eastbound when he tried to pass another vehicle by utilizing the center grass median. They say Haberland lost control, rotated across the travel lanes, struck a fence on the south shoulder, then collided with a tree. He died at the scene. Hillsborough Fire Rescue released a statement on Facebook saying Fire Medic Haberland leaves behind a legacy of dedication, bravery, and service. He was more than a brother and co-worker to us. He was a cherished member of our family. Troopers say he was not wearing a seatbelt. A LinkedIn profile says for over 18 years he worked to save people in all kinds of situations. Hillsborough Fire Rescue said Steve's commitment to serving our community was unparalleled. His unwavering bravery and selflessness in the line of duty exemplified the true spirit of a public servant. As we mourn his loss, we also celebrate the remarkable impact he had on so many lives. Please take a few moments of your day to pause in support of his family. And Hillsborough Fire Rescue does say that his family has asked for privacy. FHP's investigation is still ongoing, but they do not expect at this point that he was under the influence. Haley, piecing this one together is certainly going to be very difficult. They may never know why. Back to you. Yeah, uh, never easy to lose one of our uh, local heroes. Certainly our, our hearts are with his family and, and his fire family as well tonight. Evan, thank you.